The Calendar Boys, the enigmatic figures of the Red Dead Redemption universe. In the sprawling narrative of the Red Dead Redemption series, the stories of many characters intertwine to create a rich tapestry of outlaw life in the dying days of the American Wild West. Among these tales, the Calendar Brothers, Mac and Davy, stand out not for their on-screen presence, but for the aura of mystery that surrounds them. Their roles, or rather the lack thereof, in the games, combined with the snippets of their history, have made them subjects of intense speculation and intrigue. Background and Law Mac and Davy Callender were integral members of the infamous Vandalin Gang, a group of outlaws that played a central role in the events of Red Dead Redemption 2. Their association with such a prominent group immediately places them in the spotlight, even if they are not directly present in the game's events. Davy, known for his fondness for drink and poker, was often quoted saying, Poker builds character. Nobody can say I had a misspent youth. Poker builds character. As the saying goes. <laughs> Who said that? I think Davy Callender did. Well, we can't speak ill of the dead. Okay. This penchant for gambling and his association with the gang paints a picture of a man who lived life on the edge embracing both its pleasures and its perils. Mac, on the other hand, was a figure of legend within the gang. Tales of his feats, such as single-handedly taking on 15 sailors in a brawl, were recounted by other gang members, showcasing his physical prowess and fearless nature. You know, I once saw Mac beat up 15 sailors. <laughs> that ain't nothing. Everybody knows them Navy boys can't fight. <clears throat> That's why they float. <laughs> That's so. <laughs> sure. That ain't nothing. I once beat up 20. Such stories, while highlighting his strength, also hint at a volatile nature, a trait that might have played a role in the events leading to his demise. The mysterious absence and their fate. The events of 1899 were pivotal for the Vanderlyn gang. A botched robbery in Blackwater set them on the run, and it was during this chaos that the Calendar brothers met their fate. Davy was critically injured, a gunshot wound marking the beginning of the end for him. As the gang made their desperate escape north into the Grizzlies' west, Davy's life ebbed away, and he breathed his last in Coulter. His death was not just a loss for the gang, but also marked the beginning of the end for the once tight-knit group. Mac's fate was even more tragic. Separated from the gang during the escape, he was later captured and met a grim end at the hands of Agent Milton of the Pinkerton National Detective Agency. The details of his death, as recounted by Milton, suggest a slow and painful end, a stark contrast to the vibrant and violent life he had led. What a fine young man! And in such complex circumstances. Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? Who are you? Yes, Arthur Morgan. Vanderlyn's most trusted associate. You've read the files. Typical case. Orphan street kid seduced by that maniac's silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Agent Milton? Agent Ross. Pinkerton Detective Agency. Seconded to the United States government. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. $5,000 for your head alone. $5,000? For me? Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's so? Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Oh, ain't that a little old-fashioned nowadays? Apparently not. Listen, this is my offer, Mr. Morgan. Bring in Vanderlyn, and you have my word you won't swing. Oh, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent uh, Milton. You see, I haven't done anything wrong, aside from not play the games to your rules. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. Mac Callender? He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. So really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow, but merciful. <laughs> you enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. 
I enjoy society, flaws and all. Trivia and insights into their lives. Beyond the main narrative, several tidbits provide a deeper understanding of the Calendar brothers. Davy's grave, a silent testament to his life, can be found in Colter. After the game's opening cutscene, a mark on the map indicates Davy's final resting place, a subtle nod to his importance. Interestingly, while many in the game mourned the loss of the Calendar brothers, not all held them in high regard. Lenny and Charles were notably the only members who showed any semblance of disdain for them. However, many others, including stalwarts like Jose, Mrs. Grimshaw, Karen, Bill, Sean, Micah, Uncle, and John, often reminisced about the brothers, indicating their deep impact on the gang's psyche. Man. He was a good man. Kind of fellow you like to rob alongside. Mm, yeah. You know? Mm. Mm. Heartless son of a bitch. But he had a heart. Mm. That makes any sense. <laughs> I know what you mean. R.I.P. Mac. Mm. Yeah, damn shame. Spent all my time telling him to shut up. Now I'll miss it. Well, them calendar boys, <laughs> they were something else. <laughs> now, well, I'll miss them. Me too, big man. Me too. Well, Lenny here says they was a liability. They was, but I still miss them. The surname Calendar hints at possible Scottish origins, adding another layer to their background. Furthermore, the name Davy, derived from Hebrew, means beloved, an ironic twist given his tragic end. Theories and speculations. The absence of the Calendar brothers in the game's narrative, despite their evident importance, has led to a plethora of theories. One such theory posits Mac Calendar as the potential protagonist of a future Red Dead Redemption installment. His storied past and the mystery surrounding his death provide ample material for a gripping narrative. Another theory suggests a dual character experience, with players navigating the lives of both Calendar brothers, similar to the multi-character format of Grand Theft Auto V. Conclusion The Calendar brothers, Mac and Davey, are enigmatic figures whose stories, though largely untold, have left an indelible mark on the Red Dead Redemption universe. Their tales of bravery, camaraderie and tragedy encapsulate the essence of the Wild West, making them enduring characters in the annals of gaming lore. Whether future games will shed more light on their stories remains to be seen. Until then, they remain the phantom protagonists of tales yet to be told.